hello and welcome to you all in this video we are going to see the property type of fields in Udo so what is the property type of fields in Udo how we can use the property type of fields and if we want to add the property type of fields in our existing or any custom module or model then how we can add it so let's just first see what is the property type of fields so for this demonstration, I am selecting a CRM module. So let's just click on a CRM and opening any opportunity record. So we can see this is my opportunity record. And if I am clicking on the action, we can see the add property menu is available. So if I am clicking on it, Udo allow us to add a new field. Yeah. So through the property fields, Udo allow us to instantly add a new field in our existing view directly no need to add any code or no need to do any uh, customizations from the backend so using the property fields we can directly add the new fields in our view and these fields are stored in our existing database directly so let's just add the label i'm adding a label as the reference so the new field which is reference and the type of fields is a text so text type of fields I have added in our existing model. Here we can see add a property button. If I am clicking on it. So from here as well I can add the property fields. Is a new record. I am adding a boolean type of fields. And just save the record. So by using a property fields we can add new fields a reference and is a new record which is a boolean fields and these fields are treated same as the existing fields which we are using in opportunity record by Kodi. so the difference is the property fields are directly created in the database no need to do any uh, coding for these property fields so this is the uh, great feature by uh, Udo so now let's see if you want to add the property fields in our custom code or any custom model so how we can add it so for that let's just go to the uh, student module so student module is my uh, custom module i have created for the demonstration and if i'm clicking on any student record so we can see here on action we don't have any uh, property type of functionality for the student or student model we can check the student model from here we have a model student or student so let us add the property functionality for the student model so for that we need to jump to a code editor so let's jump to the code editor so i am on my uh, student dot student model py so this is my py file and we can see this is my student dot student model to add the property fields in our uh, student model first we need to add a definition for the property fields so what is the definition of property fields so the property definition fields is nothing but a small container which used to provide a property functionality to their sub uh, subclass records so for an example if i am going to add property fields in student or student model then i have to add a definition in a related or their parent model so for the demonstration i have added one company id field which is a race company model so let's just inherit the race company model so i have inherit the race company model i am adding one definition for property which is a fields dot property definition type of the field and we just use a string so this is the student property definition in race company is the container which provide us the functionality to add the property field in our student.student .student model so let's just add a property field in student model so i'm just uncomment the the property fields which i already created so i've added a student property field which is a fields dot properties type we have added the string of these fields as properties and here we need to add the definition so the definition which we already created in race company model and we are fetching it 
to our uh, company ID which is our uh, existing company record so through the company ID we are fetching a student property definition so every time when we add the property field the student property field the fields which use the container student property definition now let us add the student property in a view so I am opening the XML file of student student model and here let's just uncomment the field so we have added a student property fields in XML now let's just upgrade the model to check the property functionality in our student model so I am upgrading the model so I have upgraded the model now let's just refresh the screen so if you refresh the screen now let's click on action so we can see now the add property action is available if I am clicking on it would you allow us to add a property fields so let's just add a property fields is student as a boolean type of fields from here we can add a property field as well so let's just add a gender which is a selection type of fields and we can add the value male female and other so here we have added a two fields first is a gender and one is the a student boolean field and these property fields are uh, directly stored in our existing database and it is treated it is working same as the normal fields which we have added by code so this is the great feature which Udo introduced the property fields so hope you guys like these features and if you like this video please like and subscribe my youtube channel thank you for watching